I am Anil Kumar and this question we are going to solve using both permutation and combination. The question here is, to play Lato 690, you must select 6 different numbers from 1 to 49. The order of the numbers does not matter. How many ways can this be done? So in this case, we have 49 numbers. So n is equals to 49. And we know that order does not matter. So order does not matter, right? Therefore, we should use combination, right? We need to select six different numbers out of 49. So the solution is 49C6. So that becomes the solution. So we can write down the, we can calculate the answer, which is 49C6 equals to 139, let me write down, 139838816. So that is one way of doing it. Now let us try to solve the same question using permutation, right? So that is the alternate method. Let us see how permutation can be adopted to solve this particular question. Now if you see, we have to select six different numbers from 49. So that gives you a selection of 49P6. Now out of these, six which you select, they can form a combination of six factorial, right? So since the order does not matter, the six which are selected could be arranged in six factorial ways. And therefore, we could use permutation and write the number of ways as 49P6 divided by six factorial, right? So let's calculate this answer. So we have 49 P6 divided by 6 factorial, 6 factorial equals to 1398.3816. So we get exactly the same answer, right? It makes sense. So you arrange or you select 6 numbers out of, out of 49 and these numbers, since the order is not important, could be arranged in six factorial ways. So we divide it by that, and that gives you the solution. And this reminds you the relation between the permutations and combinations, right? So if you have NPR is equals to NCR times R factorial, right? So that is how they are related. And many times we can adopt permutation or combination to solve such questions. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.